what we're doing here, Matt, okay, is we, we're creating a specific style um, purely so that we can hide it from view, hide it from being printed out or viewed on the page, okay, but still allowing it searchable within Word. That's what we're doing here. Now, what you would need to do is if you click on the down arrow here and do create a style and just call it tags, yeah, and then if you click on modify, then you'll see that it's linked a style type is linked paragraph and character leave it like that style based on normal and then the style for the following paragraph is tags but you can make that normal it doesn't really matter okay now the key thing here is what we're doing is we're changing the color to white because any other color was is going to show anything that we apply the style to on the page okay so let's say for example if I make it red and I type tag tags one tags two tags three yeah it's gonna be that color now that's gonna be visible it's gonna be if I send it to my printer then it's gonna print out so what we do is we right click on the style and then we modify the color and then as soon as I make it white obviously that's what's gonna happen that's the whole reason for using styles okay because you can apply this tag style to every single tag in your document now what Eric Fletcher recommended which is an excellent idea as we modify this style and I'll just change it to red again like so and then click on format and then click on frame and then what you can do is you can select that there's a text wrapping frame around your tag so you can place them in the margin they still won't be printable but you place them let's say left relative to the page okay so you can do it to move with text or lock anchor so it's fixed in position whatever you want to do. So let's now do that within a frame like so. That's what's gonna happen with them, okay? And now if I click on the border, what I can do is I can actually resize that frame. And then I can go in and I can tweak the position and all of that. Now again, so your normal text is gonna be outside of this, but your tags, once we change the color again, are gonna be invisible, okay? And then if I type in tag, I'm gonna get three results. If I type in tags, I'm gonna get three results. If I type in tags one, I'm gonna get one result. Tags two, and so on and so forth. That's why we are using the tag style, okay? Purely because we can make it invisible, put it in a frame, and keep it away from all the rest. That's it, that's what all styles do. It's just like a grouped collection of attributes, colors, you know font size font type um, paragraph spacing and all the other things that are that are combined within these one styles you need to use styles in word because they're the quickest and easiest way to, to, to work with word they're also the safest okay and that's purely why we're, we're using it okay